30 of getting off to a great start. Today's our final day. Congratulations, you have completed 30 days of getting off to a great start. And your commitment through these 30 days show that you have what it takes to be successful in Premier. I believe in you and I know that God has a huge plan for your life. And I am just so excited to see it all unravel. to you about the highs and the lows in Premier. You are going to have so many amazing highs in this business, so many amazing, fun, lasting memories that you're going to make. You are going to have so many high moments in Premier, but only if you learn how to weather the storm. The only way you are going to get to enjoy those many, many high moments in your future with Premier is if you learn how to get through those low moments. When you figure out and make the choice to weather that storm and push through and get through those lows, then you will have the most amazing highs with Premier. who has been successful in Premier has been through hard moments and high moments and can tell you that in order to be successful in anything, you have to learn how to fail well. Anyone successful is not successful because they don't fail, but successful because they fail and choose to get back up and try again. If you're on day 30 or beyond in your business and you are at a point in your business where you are grasping at straws and you feel like you're about to give up because you look at your calendar and you have no shows left on your calendar, I want you to pause right now and I want you to say a prayer. I want you to ask God to give you strength, to give you peace, and I want you to trust Him with your business. And I want you to commit your business to Him right now before you do anything else and before you make any rash decisions. been there. We've all been in the low parts of our business where we look at our calendar and we're like, oh my goodness, I don't have any shows next month. What am I going to do? We've all been there. We've all had cancellations. We've all had um, people who say, I just don't like jewelry. We've all had that. But the difference between those of us in Premier who have become successful and those of us in Premier who join and quit, the difference is that we choose to keep trying and push through that hard moment. So you have a choice. You can either quit, go ahead, quit today, quit Premiere, and then look back and say, what if, what if I had worked a little harder? What if I had called that one person that I was a little scared to call? What if I had pushed through that fear and asked someone for a favor to help me in my business? You can choose to try harder right now. So here's what you got to do. Are you ready? Number one, you have to work a little harder. You have to go where the people are. Get out. Go to church. Go to a Bible study. 
Um, go join a networking group. Go where people are and open your mouth and tell them about Premier. You want people to understand how important that Premier is to you. People will want to help you if they know that you are passionate about something. The next thing you can do, hold a personal show. That's the easiest thing you could possibly do in this business. When you hold a personal show, you invite all the people. You're in charge of hosting that party. You don't have to ask someone else to host it for you. You are in charge of your own success. So hold a personal show, give a big special, um, hold a mystery hostess show. You invite all the people and then you put all their names into a drawing where they could earn all the free jewelry. Tell them, hey, if you come, you're gonna get a ticket. If you bring a friend with you, you'll get an extra two tickets. Just for every $25 you spend, you get another ticket. And if you book a party with me, you get 10 bonus tickets. If you join my team, you get 15 bonus tickets. And whoever's name is drawn, or whoever has the most tickets, is going to get all the free jewelry from this party. And you have to do absolutely nothing. So you make the decision, and you invite all those people over, throw a party, make it big, make it exciting, and change your business. You are just one jewelry show away from changing your business forever. You are one hostess away. You're one phone call away. You're always just one step away from changing your business and your family's life forever. It's all in the choices that you make. The next thing I want you to do is stay connected. I want you to stay connect with, connected with those past hostesses, with those past guests who came to your training show and your first few shows. Stay connected with those customers and guests Call them, check on their jewelry, treat them with royal service like you would want to be treated and they will respect you and come back to you and want to support your business. Stay connected with your upline. Your upline and your premier mom loves you so much and they are there to help you if only you will let them. So stay connected. They have been in your situation already before. So they know and they understand. All you have to do is pick up the phone and call them. Send them a text. They are there for you. I want you to know right now that I am here for you if you ever need anything at all. You pick up the phone and call me. Don't hesitate. If you have anything going on in your life or in your business, give me a call and I will be there with you every step of the way. We will get through this together. I want you to try and make five phone calls a day. Reach out and touch five people a day. That's all it takes to dramatically change your business. Picking up the phone and asking someone for a simple favor. If you will reach out to five people a day and be consistent with that, your calendar is going to be so full you don't even know what to do with it. I also want you right now, when you are done with this video, go under the YouTube search bar, type in Kim Adams Booking Boot Camp, learn from her and what she has to say about how her business was at the end, she was about to quit, and she decided to pick up the phone and ask for a favor and it changed her business forever. Go look at Booking Bootcamp and choose to do the same for your business. It will change your life. Know how many jewelry shows your family needs. Know how many jewelry shows you want each month and plan. Set goals. Don't stop until you achieve them. And that way, when you look at your calendar for next month, you can see this is where I'm at and this is how much I need to be able to have what our family needs. And you can pick up the phone and call until you get that many shows on your calendar. Go out there and make it happen. Wind your own clock and don't give up. The moment that you are ready to give up is right before you're about to hit something really big in your business. You remember that. All right, 
you're gonna do awesome. Work a little harder, ask a few more questions, reach out to more people, pick up the phone and ask for help. You have absolutely no excuse not to be successful in Premier. You have every opportunity at your fingertips, but the choice is yours whether you're going to make it happen or not. It doesn't happen overnight. It's all about what you put into this business. You're not gonna have a business until you put the work in. Put the work in and it'll pay off. If at first you don't succeed, get up and try again, right? Pick up that phone, make some phone calls. Go out and make your business successful and have fun while you're doing it. Thank you.